Okay, Happy New Year, Ron. What are the realistic similarities and differences between Hitler and Trump, in your opinion? Well, I, I, I think the biggest difference between them, I mean, there, there are a lot of differences, but, but one difference is that Germany was ready for authoritarianism um, and ready to submit uh, when Hitler rose to power, that it was far more uh, infected with uh, duty philosophy, with a, with a duty mentality, with an authoritarian view of the world, with a sense of life that was ready to just take orders than America. Is. So the biggest difference between them is the circumstances under which they came uh, to power. Uh, I think Hitler was smarter more charismatic, more devious, more cunning, more scheming, more uh, able to organize and build a movement, um, uh, but also obviously more evil and, and more despicable and more hated. And, you know, I don't, I don't think Hitler and, and I don't think there's really any similarities. I don't think Donald Trump set out to be a dictator. I think Hitler did. I don't think Donald Trump has an ideology. Hitler did. I don't think, and this is why partially why Donald Trump cannot be successful as an authoritarian is he doesn't stand for anything. He's not for anything. He doesn't, he's not an advocate for something. Right. So, uh, you know, Trump is just a, uh, you know, as a pragmatist who stands for nothing, whereas Hitler stood for something evil. So I don't put them on the same scale. I, I, I don't like the comparisons of Trump to Hitler. I don't think it's useful and, and I don't think it's helpful for anything. I don't think it, it, it aids our understanding of either Trump or Hitler. Trump is an authoritarian of a completely different kind. And, and uh, he, he is incompetent because he doesn't stand for anything, because he has no ideas, because he has no integrating principle on which to channel his energy. He is an agent of chaos more than anything else. He's not an agent of unity, which would be authoritarianism. Right? He is a, uh, you know, he is a agent of chaos. And, 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 and that does not, that, it, that will not result directly in him being a authoritarian. It will ultimately, to the extent that he's successful in being about chaos, result in somebody else becoming an authoritarian, whether again, or left or right, they will become an authoritarian partially because of the way in which the, the, the world has, uh, has, the world in which Trump is leaving us with. Um, okay. Um. What we need today, what I call the new intellectual, would be any man or woman who is willing to think. Meaning, any man or woman who knows that man's life must be guided by reason, by the intellect, not by feelings, wishes, whims, or mystic revelations. Any man or woman who values his life and who does not give, want to give in to today's cult of despair, cynicism, and impotence, and does not intend to give up the world to the dark ages and to the rule of the collectivist brute. All right, before we go on, reminder, please like the show. We, we've got 163 live listeners right now, uh, 30 likes. That should be at least 100. I figure at least 100 of you actually like the show. Maybe there are like 60 of the Matthews out there who hate it. But, but at least the people who are liking it, you know, I want to see I want to see a thumbs up. There you go. Start liking it. I want to see that go to 100. All it takes is a click of a, a, click of a, a thing, whether you're looking at this. Uh, and, and, you know, the likes matter. It, it's not an issue of my ego. It's an issue of the algorithm. The more you like something the more the algorithm likes it. So, you know, and if you don't like the show, give it a thumbs down. Let's see your actual views being reflected in the likes. But uh, if you like it, don't just sit there, help get the show promoted. Of course, you should also share and uh, you can support the show at youronbookshow.com slash support or on Patreon or Subscribestar or Locals. Uh, and uh, and show your support for all for, for for the work for the value hopefully you're receiving from this, and uh, and of course don't forget if you're not a subscriber even if you even if you just come here to troll or even if you're here like Matthew to defend Marx, uh, then uh, you should subscribe because that way you'll know when to show up 
you'll know what shows are on, when they're on. You'll get notified, right? So, um, yes, like, share, subscribe, support. Like, share, subscribe, support. There you go. Easy. Do one or all of those, please.